this place where I'm sitting right back of me here as uh, the, this background here it used to be for calisthenics display then a lot of people remember during the time of late Chief Bolaige as your state governor he will be standing there and there will be a match pass during the national Independence Day celebration or Children's Day where we have pupils marching past and Mr. Governor we have to you know throw salute to our pupils marching past well we are proud of what has happened here and we will always identify with the history of this Liberty Stadium in Ibadan. Liberty Stadium built around the celebration of Nigeria's independence in 1960 by the government of Western Nigeria under Chief Awulowo was and is still alive and actively fulfilling the objectives of its founder as the center of sports engagement, activity and development in West Africa's largest city. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. In this video, I'm going to take you into the main bowl of the Liberty Stadium, Ibadan, now called Obafemi Awulowo Stadium in Ibadan. I'm also going to show you the state of facilities, the current state of things at this Liberty Stadium. What has it turned into? What needs to be done to refurbish this place? In order to bring back the good memories of the old as it is now to the present and to the future. Thank you guys. Follow me as we take a tour around the Liberty Stadium in the battle and explore and bring about those memories of the stadium. Have this during the time we will be proud to uh, showcase the Calisex display by having some you know very colorful images of certain things like welcoming people to your state or welcoming people to Nigeria uh, you know you're showcasing our values by even promoting our cultures a lot of Calisex display here what I mean is we have pupils who have their flags we used to carry the flag you know on our side like this we are always proud. Then I was at about a boys' high school. Then, don't go down at the days. So, when we are in there, we will showcase. We show the beauty. We will use the flag. The flag will mean along this background here will mean something. Just like what we have here, LSI Liberty Stadium. So this Liberty. is where we sit. Then we will just be sitting right here in this one of the seat here. It's already planned so that we wave our flag. And our flag will definitely, you know, mean something. It will mean a lot of things like welcome to Nigeria, welcome to our state, Thanks. greetings oh. to people, or showcase our culture, you know. Uh, we showcase that this is our state, the pay center. Those calisthenics display that we used to do along, you know, over here at this background here shows a lot of beauty, you know. It showcases our state as a pay center state, and also we showcase different beautiful culture. Uh, colors you know around here that was all those things we are very proud of and we wish this come back to Liberty Stadium in Ibado this is where you know if you have tickets you gotta come over here at the entrance here at the gate well there may be some private uh, uh, firm running or um, making use of the building at the moment, but we used to come through that gate. This is gate J, that's gate I. So we used to come down here. Then, our school student there, we used to come to live out this stadium yeah. where we're always very proud. We are the, dog, 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 dog. We're always proud, of, yeah. <laughs> so, uh, so we are always very proud of uh, our Liberty Stadium here, yeah. yeah we are always proud of it, and even the school boys are always very proud of it. Yeah, we are footballers. Ah, that's good. Okay. Ah, that's good. Uh, now I'm meeting one of the school boys who are actually coming from school. I think they're coming for after a training program. Which school do you, what, 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 what academy do you say you, you are from? Uh, you? I do LFC. No, what's your name anyway? My name is 
Tomboy. Tomboy. They call you Tomboy. Yeah. Is that your real name or just yeah. a nickname? That's your nickname. And you? Samuel. So what, what wing do you pay for for the Adewali FC? Mifida. Yeah, Mifida. And how about you? Mifida. Mifida. So when we say Young Shagro, these yeah. boys are actually uh, undergoing in the academy training right now with Adewali FC. There are a number of uh, football clubs around in the battle. Uh, they are very proud to be part of it. And you guys, you just need to keep up doing what you've got to do. All right? Make sure you focus on your trainings and everything. And your names too? Somewhere. Somewhere. So, these guys are actually, you know, promising football star to watch out for, you know, in very nearest future. So, what what was your age, 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 age group? And my, and my age is 12. No, I mean, yeah, yeah. So, you are teenagers. You are under 13. Yes. Okay, yes. So, oh, that was. So, we hope to see you guys at the top. Thank you. Yeah, Enjoy your day, guys. Exactly. Are you going for training or you're coming from training? Yeah, I'm going for training? All right. So the boys are going for training at the evening time like this. This is it. The value that we need to promote about it. And my background is the Liberty State of Nevada, and it's got a lot of uh, training pages which you guys are actually using. We have to be very proud of what we've got. This is it. Thank you, guys. Make sure you subscribe to my channel. Subscribe, please, if you haven't done so, and leave your comment. There's more of this to come. Thank you. Guess what? I'm sitting right inside the main bowl of Liberty Stadium in Ibadan, Nigeria. This edifice, this particular stadium, built years back by late chief Obafemi Awolowo. Actually, it's what is actually the first stadium ever built in Nigeria, and it's still looking not very much like the Hoosh, but it's still looking. Uh, futuristic. Well, a lot of development has taken place. This is actually a property of Federal Ministry of uh, Youth and Sports and it has undergone different uh, forms of refurbishment. I could remember vividly years back, precisely 1999, when Nigeria uh, hosted the uh, Junior World Cup. Well, I was one of those people who have to come on the page here to work in order to, you know, uh, work on the page, either to cut the grass, you know, in order to make the stadium look very much, you know, uh, ready for the World Cup then in 1999. And successfully, this stadium, with all its equip um, facilities, you know, was regarded as actually the best stadium in Nigeria. Reasons for? It has a large open space for car park. It also has, not just that, facilities, open space for people, spectators around the world who can come over to Liberty Stadium and see, you know, and enjoy their time in Ibadan. Ibadan is just about um, 160 kilometers away from Lagos, which is the vibrant, you know, city of Nigeria. So, this is Liberty Stadium in Ibadan. This is it. Yes, this seats are still there, plastic, made around just for the World Cup 1999 and they are still looking much intact. What needs to be done is the other side there, which I believe work needs to be done by the Federal Ministry of Youth and Sports to please resuscitate, I mean refurbish those, uh, uh, the coverage, the cover there, which will actually be, you know, make this stadium be very good in shape well and the pitch as well the pitch needs to be done you can see the grass not fully you know uh green because you can see the soil on the on the pitch it's neat refurbishment so we have to be proud of what we have in nigeria i, I believe you guys you know uh you would like to have see to see more of this subscribe to my channel if you haven't done so please I've come all the way to make sure I go to the nook and crannies of every part of Nigeria to showcase you the beauty. Look at that. That very mighty long, um, what's it called? Flood light. It used to supply us a very good light during the World Cup. You will be seeing a lot of people. I can remember countries like Ireland, Germany, um, some other countries uh, uh, of, of the group during the World Cup, you know, 
were actually stationed here and you see people from around the world sitting together closely there i wish i can we can get the images of the nigeria world cup and some more other tournaments of uh, fifa that nigeria has hosted please this place needs lot of support it needs to be refurbished we need to re-equip all the facilities we've got the medical let me show you this is a, these are the medical facilities then that very big massive building it used to be like a kind of a hospital or college medical center and we have the media center over there we have the gymnastics we have the uh another sports of like a javelin um taquendo we have the sports hall there just over there at the back of this uh the stadium is actually the swimming pool we have the swimming plaza there we have a lot of other facilities the stadium is very big it has a last you know um land a very massive space that sports spectators can come over here and enjoy and have a good time but what we're having now is that this stadium we're just having what we call for leisure people come down here evening time to have a drink because there are shops actually opening just by the liberty stadium this is it liberty stadium Ibado. we are proud of these very facilities and we hope these facilities actually you know improve and so that uh, we continue to enjoy sports and you know grow our sport in nigeria This is the road leading to the Liberty Stadium and it is called Liberty Road, very popular in Ibadan. Currently, in June and July 2021, this road is being undergoing repair and we hope that this continues and also give a facelift to the stadium. This, is, this road leads into the stadium and also the main stadium also needs lots of attention and needs to be refurbished. There are lots of memories of Liberty Stadium and this we would not allow this to be erased. There were the time when the first global boxing event was held here in Nigeria and that was uh, the fight between the Tigers which was actually hosted in this very Liberty Stadium. There are lots of memories that we will not allow it to be erased. Can